Understanding the tactical phases of the game is essential for any coach who wants to lead their team to victory. In this video, we'll break down the four key phases that every football game goes through and we'll explain how to make the most of each one. Phase 1. Own team has possession. Opponent is organized. In Phase 1, your team has the ball but the opponent is well organized in their defense. The goal here is to create scoring opportunities by moving the ball effectively. Here are the key strategies. Spread out and cover the field in depth and width. Create passing opportunities by getting open, playing without the ball, and forming triangles or diamonds. Play the ball across different lines and take advantage of one-on-one -on -one situations. Remember, diagonal runs work best with straight passes and vice versa. Keep the ball moving with quick touches to create space and combinations. The aim is to be bold and take risks, especially in the attacking zone, to put pressure on the opponent. Phase 2. Opponent has possession own team is disorganized. Phase 2 is all about reacting quickly when your team loses possession, often due to a bad pass or mistake. The priority is to transition from offense to defense as fast as possible. Get as many players as you can behind the ball to limit the opponent's space. When outnumbered, focus on protecting the goal rather than going after the ball. Narrow down the playing area into a tight, funnel-like formation. Quick reactions in this phase can make all the difference in stopping the opponent's attack. Phase 3. Opponent has possession. Own team is organized. Now, let's talk about Phase 3, where your team has regrouped and the opponent has the ball. The goal in this phase is to win the ball back through disciplined defense. All players need to contribute to the defense, forming a compact block. Stay close together and use ball-oriented defense to create pressure near the ball. Block the opponent's passing lanes and maintain a safe distance from your goal. Form defensive triangles to cover more space and create an optimal defensive shadow. The key is to defend aggressively yet smartly keeping the pressure on without committing fouls. Phase 4. Own team's possession. Opponent is disorganized. Finally, we reach Phase 4, where your team has the ball and the opponent is disorganized. This is your golden opportunity to strike quickly. Quickly switch from defense to offense and immediately look to move forward. Pass into the seam area and drive the attack with high-speed runs or tempo dribbling. This phase is all about seizing the moment, as you often have only 6 to 10 seconds before the opponent's defense gets back into shape. If the quick counter-attack isn't possible, secure the ball and transition back to a more controlled build-up, taking the game to phase 3. If you liked this video, please consider subscribing to the channel for more insights and tactical tips.